Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will learn how to convert PDF data format into Excel data format. Now, let us imagine that you are provided with a huge PDF document and that PDF document consists the tabular data. And your manager asks you to copy all that data of PDF into an Excel sheet. Now, let us imagine that that PDF has 100 rows. So, even 100 rows can be copied from PDF to Excel. But what if there were 1000 rows? It would be a little complicated, right? So today we will learn how to extract data from PDF format to Excel within just a few steps. Now let us begin with our one point agenda that is convert PDF into Excel. Now to do this, let's get back to the practical mode and try to convert some PDF data into Excel. Now you can see the PDF document which I am looking to convert from PDF to Excel. So this particular PDF document has a table. So this is the state-wise GST collections that happened during March of 2020. Now we need to convert this tabular data from PDF format to Excel format. Now we are on the Microsoft Excel. Now to initiate the process, we might want to choose a blank workbook for this. So now we are on the blank workbook and the complete sheet is empty. Now let's go into the data option in the toolbar. And in the data option of the toolbar, we have the ribbon of get and transform data. In this ribbon, you can see get data option. Select that and you can see various options here from file, from database, from Azure, from other sources, etc. Now we need the first option that is from file. And in that we have a drop down. And in that drop down, you might want to select the PDF. If you have a JSON file, you can also choose from a JSON. And if you have the data from XML, you can choose that. And even you can extract the data from text or CSV as well. Now we need the PDF option. So select the PDF. Now navigate where your file is existing. So my file is on the desktop. And now let me select the PDF document. Select import. Now Excel will automatically analyze the tabular data in the PDF format and give you the results. Now according to Excel, there are multiple tabular formats. Table 1, Table 2. So basically this table is one and the same. So all the 29 states are fixed in one table itself. But since the PDF is divided in sheets, this particular document is considering the first table as a separate table and the table which is present in the third page as a separate table. So we have table 1, table 2 and there are a few more tables which Excel is assuming that it might be table but it's not and another table which is page number 002 it is a table and another one is right here. Now there is an option of selecting all the tables all together at once or you can select only one table which you want to select. So if you select multiple items Excel will automatically give you an option of choosing your tables. You can just tick and select the tables you want. Or you can directly select the table you want on your Excel sheet. So right now, let's try to select multiple tables. So I'll be selecting 1, 2, 4 and 5. And this particular one is not a table, so I'm eliminating that. Now you might want to choose the load option. So Excel is now loading the data. Now all the data has been successfully loaded. Now. Yeah, it is giving us a notification that all the data has been successfully loaded. And now just right click on it and here choose the option load to. And here select table option. And if you want the data to be, uh, you know, loaded to a new worksheet, you can choose that and select OK. Now you can see all the data is been successfully loaded in the form of tabular format in the new Excel sheet. Similarly, let's try to load another page. In the table format, new worksheet, select OK. And the third sheet,
Now get ready to impress your boss by converting all the PDF data into Excel sheet just in a matter of few seconds with few steps. And there you go. All the four tables have been loaded successfully in the form of Excel in just a few steps. Now this is how you convert PDF to Excel. With that we have come to an end of this session. If you have any queries regarding the topics covered in this session, then please feel free to let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be happy to resolve all your queries. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.